All right, welcome to the Aero app training series videos. This is gonna be a general overview. And if you need anything more detailed, you can go into many of the other videos in this series for specific Aero app functionality. All right, so we open up in the Aero app you see here and we are always gonna come into the app management screen once it loads. And this is gonna give you a breakdown of um, all of the app management tabs. So we're going to go into each of these tabs in separate sections and separate videos. We just want to give you a general overview of the application and kind of how you use it in and out. You can see here it's tab based and you can slide back and forth with the different tabs uh, up top. You can go into preferences. We'll show you a quick base on that and preferences where you can set each of the individual preferences for the entire application as a whole, such as take the menu bar to the top or the bottom. Over the top left, you have a search bar where you can search for airports, nav aids, waypoints, airways. It'll show you your recent searches. It'll be able to separate and filter by ICAO name and distance. Then going from left to right, working on the top bar, you have the airport information tab. You have a moving map. You have a general tab. You have a notepad, which allows you to keep notes and, and to write down anything that you need like clearances. Next to that, we have the E6B, which will give you a breakdown of all the E6B functions. And again, we'll go over all of these in detail in their own separate videos. After that, you have weather and images, which is pretty great for any of the downloaded data that you have when you're hooked up to wireless uh, or using your cell service, you can go in and look at uh, weather images and um, the like for any type of data you might want and back into the app management. If you notice for all of these top tabs, these are the primary tabs, and then you have supplemental tabs underneath. So in each section, you have a supplemental series of tabs. You can go back and forth again to find more. And in this case, our airport information tabs, we have information that's our general overview, kind of a once over the world, which is a great place to start for any of your information. Um, and then you have your moving map. When you're moving map, your supplemental tab is actually your navigation bar. And then each of those have supplemental tabs and we'll go into more detail uh, in the rest of the video series for each individual tab as we go through. If you look at the top right, you have a red arrow that goes up and what that does is that's gonna hide your tab bars. So let's say you're on the moving map and you wanna hide your tab bars, you can get rid of it just like that and it'll leave your navigation open. Same thing with the bottom left, you have a tab bar and that's gonna bring out your current flight route. And we'll go over more detail of that for the flight planning portion. That includes our general overview of the Aero app. Continue on in the series to find out specific details about each tab as we walk through those.